Let's say you have to work with a cross-functional team of people to get them all pulling in the same direction. That's not easy, is it? It can, be, it can be a real headache. So the idea here is think of a metaphor that represents the problem you're trying to solve. So you go, hmm, bringing a whole bunch of cross-functional people together. That's like uh, raking leaves in the windstorm, or that's like, okay, herding cats. All right, it's like herding cats. So the idea here is ju don't just think of the metaphor, but then think about how would I really herd cats? And then come up with a crazy solution to your metaphor, and then see if that gives you any inspiration about how to pull these people together. So that's the way to use metaphors. By the way, this is not just something that they teach you in creativity class. They do teach you that, but it really works in the real world. A few years ago, I was working with a client who was implementing a very complex, very big project, and it was going very, very well for weeks. They, they had a great plan, they were working their plan, and in the last week, it got stuck. In the last week, they just couldn't go forward. Um, so. Um, we were sitting on a Friday afternoon talking about what to do and everybody was bummed out and despondent and even the team leader, poor guy was sitting there, he was just slumped over and just kind of staring out the window and I thought, oh man, we're sunk. Well, all of a sudden he said, no wait, I've got an idea. I know what we need to do. We need to take these last steps in a different order. And everybody sat up and looked and he explained it and they all bought into it and they went out the next week and they did it in a different order and it worked. So a couple of weeks later, I did a debrief with him on the project, and I said, how did you come up with that idea? And he got kind of this sheepish grin on his face, and he said, you know what, I really was daydreaming. I was already out on my sailboat. We were, I was gonna go sailing over the weekend, and I was on my boat sailing uh, while I was sitting in this room, and uh, I got to thinking about sailing, and uh, I got to thinking about, oh yeah, when you sail into the wind. Well, you all know, you can't sail a boat into the wind, right? What do you have to do if you need to go to windward? If I need to go over there and the wind's in my face, what do I have to do? You gotta tack, you gotta zigzag. And he said, honest to God, Lynn, that's where I got that idea. We were trying to sail into the wind. And we can't sail straight into the wind, we gotta zigzag. So that's where he got his inspiration. So try it, try using metaphor.